Welcome to your tour of the Woodward Detention Center. This is a supermax prison, so no entry unless you're supposed to be in here, unless you're a prisoner here. This is a detention center, so it's, um, some people are here for life, some people are here for a few days, but most, you're gonna find your creepers, your zombies, and people who try to damage BART property, which BART stands for BIOS Rapid Transit. So those are the kind of people you will find in detention, and... No, they don't have to draw trains or anything like that. They're just going to just stay in detention. So we're going to fill some of these cells today. And um, hopefully all goes well. Nobody escapes. Get me some iron bars. But we are filling this prison today. Because there's a lot of detainees. Yeah, once we get a hold of you, we will not let you go. It's not so easy, you can't just go home. You gotta serve or else you try to escape, your time only gets longer. What struck me odd is that most of these cells don't have any source of light. So, we're gonna fix that. I could do this on my own, I'm just gonna, um... Yeah, no light in the hallway, so this is not very good for a prison. These big doors, they separate the two wings. So that's the minimum security wing. In this wing, you are entitled to a bed. And that's about it. You get a bed. This is the maximum security wing. This is a supermax prison, so we don't have a minimum security. Notice how the cells in here are smaller. Here's less space. And... This is space for a bed, but we're not going to give you a bed today. No, no beds. Each cell does have to have capacity for two men. Anybody who escapes, of course, the pillagers will be called. The pillagers, their job is to keep the prison secure and make sure that no one is escaping. This is an escape-proof penitentiary, so therefore, the doors only stay open for about a second. Which does make it hard to load the prisoner sometimes. There are a lot of rooms on this hall, but this is just one out of, this is a three-story building. This is the torture cell, which is used for if a prisoner gets combative. No, there will never be any lights. A pillager just fell into magma. That's what that is. Yeah, so this torture cell, there's a prisoner in here now, and he doesn't follow directions, so therefore he receives the torture cell. This is uh, another form of the torture cell. There's no light in here on purpose, not because we haven't put it in yet. And this one only does one prisoner, but there's no light in there on purpose. Yeah. This is your view through one of the windows. 
Most views you're gonna get just the yard. This is the first floor of the prison. This is our maximum security. So maximum security, two doors do open at a time. This is for ease of transfer. But this is how small the space is. This is a one man space. So no one is able to just come out. You see through these iron bars, you have another set of iron bars and I've been given permission to destroy this part of the prison just to show you what you have to go up against if, during an escape attempt. But this is maximum security. Now, people want to come out of the yard, but nobody's allowed out in the yard. They stay in there. Let's go upstairs. So this is what makes this penitentiary a real penitentiary. These are the nicer cells. These are the cells you want to be in if you should ever wind up at Woodward Penitentiary, I mean Detention Center. Oh, there are four floors of this. You see those guards? Those are pillagers. This is the yard. It's a better view of the yard. I know my 10 minutes are almost up, so I'm going to go. But I do want to remind you that if you behave yourself and don't commit any crime, we will not give you detention. And most importantly, we're not going to detain you for the rest of your life. The next video, you will get to see the death house, which that goes for zombies that have killed a lot of villagers. Next video. Thank you for coming on the tour with us. Bail at this detention center is no matter what, always $20,000. This is why nobody's ever gotten out before. You can't bail people out. So I guess I'm not bailing my friend out today. So bye. Have a great day. Thank you for watching Bios Cosmos Church YouTube channel. And please subscribe and please continue standing by for religious content. So these aren't escaped inmates. These are children that just so happened to made it onto the roof. Now, as you see, they are growing up into adults because these were children. But now they're old enough to be killed by the pillagers, which I can't find any. Oh, yeah, yeah. This one's not where it's supposed to be, so getting to the death house is going to be an issue. This one's just outside the prison gate, too close to the prison wall. He could get um, killed that, like that. This prison is, um, it's a very big prison. It's a very big Minecraft prison. Okay, I really do have to go now. See you later. Next video. Recording stopped.